See, back-to-back -back fights. With no chance. This is what I wasn't able to do. So we'll see if this works. Hey, rabbit, what's up? Okay, so this chicken needs to die with his 300 health before we can kill Eliphaz the Extra Grim. More enemies are going to spawn here. And you have to kill them all. Because we discovered that killing the chicken and the necromancer is not enough. It's not enough. The only one that gets to go before all of the enemies, pretty much, is the ranger. And all he's going to do is buff. This is terrible. Okay. We're gonna need the ogre to try to figure out where that chicken is. He's got the sniff ability. He can sniff out a stealth character. Because this, this chicken's gonna go stealth right away. I think we'll just send the Barbarian right up. I wonder if I should have a couple of people try to take on whatever's down here. But maybe not. I don't know. I'm going to put everybody over here again. So aren't they going to stun everybody? They're going to stun everybody. That's like the first thing they do. By the way, Bond, congrats on my new pet rabbits. <laughs> what do you mean, outside? You gotta see how crazy, like, I, I did a lens post uh, yesterday showing what Azaria did for the bunnies out in our backyard. Today, it's even crazier. Long story short, the, the bunnies are usually in a nest underground covered up with, like, grass and hay on the top by the mom, right? There was so much flooding this weekend that the bunnies were all outside of the nest because it filled with water and they were freezing in the 50 degree weather. So Azaria takes a Tupperware bin, cuts uh, o cuts an opening, fills it with like ripped up blankets and straw, nice and dry, puts it in the yard, puts all the bunnies inside of it, covers it with a lid so they're protected from the rain. And they loved it. The mom came and was hanging out in there and like the bunnies were all like nice and dry. Well, today it's sunny out. And she's like, well, normally they're in the little hole kind of out of the sun. So now the sun's like beating directly on this Tupperware. So now she put like a, like a shade, like a blanket and propped it up over the whole thing. So now it's out of the sun. So she just keeps building this thing in our backyard for the bunnies. But I have no fear, Sparkwood, of uh, having pet rabbits though. Uh, it is the thing I am most highly allergic to next to dust. So there's no way, there's no way we're gonna have rabbits. All right, let's try this. Chicken's going to disappear, and we have no idea where it goes. <sighs> Hold on a sec. Zari is like sending me pictures. She's uh, getting her hair did for this wedding coming up. Um, all right, the ranger from Lubeg. How did this? I, I didn't even see how this. I didn't even see how that guy got there. Um. Gonna take one attack of opportunity here. 
just so I can get in range of the Necro. And then let's get everybody buffed. Ranks. Everybody's buffed. And now look at all these people that get to go. Yeah. Dust or dander, six foot five says. My, the, my, my two biggest allergies are dust um, and rabbit for some reason. There's no way, Sparkwood. No. No, and these aren't the kind of rabbits you have yeah, as pets hey, either. So these, are, these are literally wild rabbits, yeah. It's revenge for the stolen bunnies, obviously. Obviously, yes. In your dreams. It's way too many people in this fight. Like, have I gotten to go? No. And they all go first. It's not fair. My guys are like almost dead before I get to go. There you go. Hit him for 18. Okay. Do I want... I think I want to delay... No. Uh... See, this, this is such a cheap setup. They have they have these death berserkers, right? Sitting here doing this AoE attack that takes one round. So you're like, crap, I got to get these guys out of this AoE. But then they put these archers in overwatch stance. So if anybody moves, they get shot. So you either get shot or you take the AoE. Um, I think... I don't think I'm going to throw the dwarf. Just yet. Right? Because we got to find the chicken first. Yeah, my randomy is full. I, I, trust you me. You are an insult to wizardry. The, the, here's, here's what the, they do. I can I could take somebody and uh, give them an extra turn. I can heal an injury on one person. I can teleport one character to a tile of your choice, which we may have to use once we know where the chicken is. And then heal one injury and give us health points back to six random characters in the party. Yeah. All right, so I think we'll take the shot. How was that a backstab? <sighs> hey, he hit his friend. That was beautiful. And now let's push this guy. And, yes, there we go. So look, not only do you not get to do your AoE, you got knocked back, attacked of opportunity, and stunned. <laughs> okay, now this is the sniff. An ogre sniffs the air a couple of times, then randomly picks uh, an enemy as his next meal. The target suffers a protection penalty. Also reveals any stealthy enemies in the area of effect. And what's the AOE on this? I don't know if I'm close enough to sniff. I kind of want to get up here. Or I do it, but I'm going to take two shots to get up here. I guess I have to. Nice, he missed. Oh, I found the chicken! I don't even need to sniff! I don't even need to sniff. Are you kidding me? So what do I need to do to this thing? Uh, Burp it? Burp the chicken. This will do half of its life. We don't want to push it away. I gotta burp it, maybe. And try to stun it? I know, I'm a chicken chaser. Let's try. I've won the lottery. Mm -hmm. I know. Stunned! I stunned the chicken! I stunned the chicken! I stunned the chicken! You know what? That's cause for celebration. Why do we keep helping out the baddies? Celebrate good times, come on! 
Cause celebrate, have good time. You come together, it's up to you. Uh, oh, what's your pleasure? That's, that's the bad thing. That's the bad thing about my house being in disarray. I can't find what I'm looking for. Oh well. I failed, guys. I have a chicken hat somewhere, but I can't find it. I'm happy, though. Alright, Elf's turn. What happened to her? She can't move. Okay, beautiful. She's webbed. So I can't use anything because we have an opponent in melee range. Okay. Uh... All enemies in the area of effect. That's just one enemy. Can we heal somebody? Anybody need healing already? Herself, of course, and she can't heal herself. Damn it. Only thing I can do is this. Hands to Rick. Check on! Eliphaz moved over there. Ferocious Pounce over here. I don't know what to do. I feel like, I feel like right now is a very key moment. Key moment. Like, do I keep him over here? Because we're going to have ads coming in over here soon. Do I have the barbarian? Or do I go for the triple hit on these three? I'm going to go for the triple hit on these three. I don't know if that's right. <gasps> Killed one, stunned one. Okay. Feel like maybe he should take another turn. No. Not yet. Summon an undead troll. This guy's such a pain in the butt. I wish I could like, I wish I had a move to teleport him away. I'm alive! Thief. Yeah. Crush him! <laughs> oh, wow. Okay. We did a lot of damage there. Um, do I want to do firebirds? These two are full health death knights over here. Let's freeze them. Or try. Crit hit and both frozen. Cheesy peasy lemon squeezy. This is great. Fantabulous. Yeah, I don't know where to move her. I'm going to keep her there. <laughs> I don't know where to move her. Uh, I'm immune to whatever you tried. Did he try to freeze me? He tried to fr freeze my ghost thief. I wonder if they'll leave the thief as a ghost. A brutal charge. Wow, look at this. Oh, it's next turn, though. 
What are the chances he's still going to be there next turn? And we can just smack this guy for a little damage. Should we try the charge? Screw it. He'll never be there. Okay, here comes reinforcements next turn. Chicken is stunned. This guy's gonna hit. No. Oh, come on. <laughs> Backstab my priest? What a coward. We gotta kill the chicken. Uh. the damage on that 72 to 82 let's move him up and 72 to 82 on the hurtful shot too let's do this this is going to do more damage got to get the chicken down All right, 140 health left. Hopefully the ogre can take it out. I already did a mid save fight, rabbit. <laughs> and they they auto save at the beginning of every turn as well. He's going to move. Don't move. Stay right there. I Jaruk. Okay, he's Okay. <laughs> well, that was a fail. <sighs> he didn't move, though. <laughs> oh, yes, he did. All right, he and he moved. Okay. Well, there we go. So one bad thing about how this is playing out is we're going to kill the chicken, but all my good fighters are on the complete opposite side <laughs> of the map. And they keep picking on my priestess. And these two are going to not be frozen soon. Oh, you can eat with my... <sighs> okay. All right, you cannot let me down here, Ogre. You got to kill it. Two slaps, two slaps. Slap the chicken twice. <laughs> slap, slap. Chicken's down. Chicken is down, and oh, look at that! It looks like chicken is back on the menu. Um, skeletal bowman's probably not worth paying attention to. Let's bring him around here. She's like totally useless, surrounded by enemies. I wonder if I should teleport her. It's going to use a lot of my randomia, though. Should I teleport her? I don't even know where to put her. I guess. At least now she can do something. Like, hurt these three guys. <laughs> of course, the first guy dodges. since the guy that I wanted to hit. Um, stinking boots. Terrifying blow. Powerful swing. Wow. 
critical failure on my AOE. Nice. Thank you. Ah. Boom! Dodge that one. Backstab. Ah. Come on. Crowd control in a game where it takes you a half hour to get back to your turn is so frustrating. If I'm willing to hurt everybody there, I can do an AOE. Uh, I can get those two. Let's just do Firebirds. Firebirds! Hey, Sakura! Why you bother with those robes? Would you stop with the critting of the... Why Firebirds? Why do you have to miss every time with the crit failure on Firebirds? Screw that spell! That's the worst spell! That's, that's like at least three times since I've been streaming this. Three times? Why? Why you have to crit fail? Oh, cheesy, peasy, lemon squeezy. Like that is a ridiculous amount of times. I can see my mouth shake when I did it. All right, um, should I give her another turn? Like I feel like I would just, just have an AOE I can use. Now it's on cooldown. Whatever. I know. Hi, Sakura. <laughs> That's so annoying. And he crits me. My door slippers, help! And then he crits. You guys can't come here. What if I stand here? Can you... What if I stand right here? Can you... Can you guys get here if I'm there? Rock throw. I can't throw anything. These guys aren't in the combat yet. I can't overwatch. Look, they walk right through you. And then there's two more yahoos coming. Do you see how ridiculous this fight is? Do you see? Maybe a staff level or two low? We're max level, Night's Dream. It's just random. It's just random. It's just, it keeps happening on I have one, literally one spell in the game that can hit five people. Firebirds. And in the last two days, that one spell has crit failured three times while I've been streaming, which burns her and cancels the spell and puts it on a cooldown and it makes me cry. It literally, it makes me cry. It's true. And this Necro seems to learn how to go to the exact spot where my guys can't get him. Um, but I'm burning! Shush. Ouch! Shush. You deserve to burn with your crit fail, your fire birds. I don't want to hear your belly aching. You hear me? I don't want to hear it. Now they get, what, six people to go in a row. All right. He's not frozen anymore. Ah! He's gonna try to move. He is moving. Okay. What the hell is that? Execute. Stop picking on my rogue, please. Okay, the rogue is just, he's just dead. Nothing I can do there. They just picked on him and he continues to run. Ah, slick as a bar so. Right, at least he's keeping them entertained. Ah! 
I've got the moves. I've got the moves. Strolling by. I was just strolling by. Um, I'm gonna try to knock him over. And boom! Fail me! Nope, it did not stop. But I wanted it to stop. Okay, eat him. Eat him and heal. This guy's not going anywhere. The elf has flanked him. Long shot, immobilize. Come on. <laughs> nice, it's crit and he's chained. Ridiculous. <laughs> too many, too many ads. Alright, what's wrong with the barbarian? Why is he why is he why is he slumped over? What's wrong with you? Can I, how do I put waypoints in where I want them to move? I thought there was a way to do that. Come on. Control click, is that what it is? Thank you. Thank you, thank you, Nolan. I can't believe how many enemies there are. No! It does too much damage. Oh, your dreams! Huh? 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 Uh. I guess she's gotta heal herself. Well, I can't move. Thief is down. Ah! Yeah, suffering from firebirds. Oh. If I slap this guy away, no. Nope. Okay, this this will work. Slap that guy away. Oh come on! I'm not doing the wizard anymore. I'm just gonna skip your turn from now on. You're useless. <laughs> She's useless. <That's> <laughs> Why? What is wrong with you? Do I have? Some is there something wrong with her? I don't know because you can't check your character while you're in combat. So, I don't know if there's something wrong. Maybe there is. I'm going to give her another move. There. You got another move. Okay? Now. Please. Please stop failing. Okay. She did something, gang. She did something. Stop. 
Just go. Okay. Terrifying scream. I feel like I should wait till these two guys show up. But he might be gone by then. So what does it do? It reduces physical and magical resistance of your enemies by 20% for three turns. So yeah, let's just attack this turn. Rusty Nails! Thanks for following! <laughs> There they are. It's right after he goes. Do you see this? I want people to start agreeing with me that this is ridiculous. Is this ridiculous? This fight is ridiculous. We've got no one no one really here to kill this guy. Euclid shall put you to rest. Uh Rusty Nails been a fan since legendary days from the Game Breaker days. Awesome. That was a long time ago. But welcome. I'm glad you found me. I got first blood. First blood. Now we get six of them. I don't even want to watch. I don't even want to watch. This is where it all comes crumbling to a halt. Oh, no. Sakura just redeemed a game ball giveaway with 100,000 manners. Thank you. Thanks, Sakura. <laughs> All right, gang, when a mod is ready, they will kick off a giveaway. It's going to be one clam to enter. Max. It is a gift. A gift to the friends of the otters. Max of 500. It's for a game from the Game Vault. Sparkwood, thank you so much for gifting a sub to Rusty Nails. Rusty Nails, refresh your stream so you don't get any more ads. And, gang, if we get four more, four more newer gifted subs, it'll be a double Game Vault giveaway. Exclamation point vault to see the games that are up for grabs. Winner will choose any game from the vault, and I'll send it to you tonight. It Thank is a you. gift. A gift to the friends of the, the otters. And Thorny the Subject. The trees. Thorny Subject just gifted a sub to Sakura. Thank you, Thorny Subject. There we go. There's two newer gifted subs for the day. Three more will do a double game vault giveaway with this raffle. Thank you, gang. You guys rock. I think you're just trying to make me feel better because I'm complaining so much about this fight being impossible. Impossible. Deals heavy damage to the target. If it kills, it grants a courage bonus to all enemies. Uh, to all, not enemies, allies. Why can't I hit this one with it? How funny is that? Why? I don't understand. Heavy damage to a target. Do this. Ha! Your legs are too short. Uh, oh, it can only be used if the attack is supported by two allies. I wish there was an undo. Hmm. I didn't read. I didn't read my spell. It's okay. We need to kill this guy anyway. All right. All right, so anybody just get gifted a sub, please refresh your uh, stream so you don't get any more of those ads. All right, what can we do with the ogre on this guy? Tremors. I think we're going to go up and bump him to the ground, maybe? Let's bump him back this way. It's gonna take an attack of opportunity. I probably could have avoided it. No, I only took one. It's fine. Let's bump him this way. <laughs> and he's on the ground. Nice. Okay. Elf.
Can she kill him? No. 148 health. Maybe kill him. Crit! She left him with five! Five! Look at this! Look at this! Like, I, I have to fight like a whole nother fight when I'm done. And these two guys are gonna join. Like, I really don't understand. Nelmok Zaleb. Let's see their boons to the dogs. And he healed. That did 142. I am flabbergasted by this fight. Doesn't mean you can't improve. This is. I'm gonna. I'm gonna say this is a little bit of frustrating game design. Like just limitless ads that just come in. I don't get it. How is it? How is that like balanced? Everything I have is on cooldown. Like, um... I guess I'll take an attack of opportunity. So I can utilize... A terrifying blow. Which they're immune to. Oh no, they're both scared. Take this, chicken shit! There we go. Oh, you left him alive. He's like, where did I go? Hey, I want to be back here. Can I get... the thief up? No, because the only... He well, I can do a healing wave. Okay, fine. Yeah, it is a tense fight, Alex. It is. And I... I failed it so many times. Last week and yesterday. I'm just hoping that this is the this is the time that you pull it off. Uh, okay, so we can go over here. And we can get a cowardly strike to kill the big necro. Which will give us another action. Cowardly, but efficient. And I don't think I can do anything else with my extra turn, years. really. I can shoot this guy. It's gonna knock him into the ranger? No, let's just do a poison bolt. Don't knock him into the ranger. Regal Peach, you have won oh. the Game Vault giveaway. Congratulations. Just send me a message on Discord and I will send you your game tonight. Congrats. All right, wizard. Just, she really has to drink a potion now, doesn't she? Just smack this guy. She's out of energy. <laughs> this guy's like lost. Nobody's fighting you. Nobody cares. Oh. Except for the ranger from Lube. Yeah, don't forget to speak up. Regal Peach, you have won the giveaway. You need to type something in chat to claim your prize. All right, so here we go. Now we're going to howl out the moon. We're not even going to get everybody. It's fine. From dust to dust. Okay. I don't know what I would have done without this troll. Ice arrow, no! Thank God. Oh my God, thank God. All right, Regal Peach, there you go. Yeah, you won, you won the raffle. Congrats. Two 
two more people. Axe is this way. So I can get a triple if I move all the way up here? Hell yeah. Hell yeah, I move up there. Let's get the triple axe going. Yeah, get all three. Well, let's see. I don't know which one three to get. I guess these three. Four of them in a row. This has to be one of the hardest fights game. I think it's the final fight of the DLC for the path that I chose. But yeah, it's ridiculously hard. I did change it back to normal for this fight. <laughs> Um, kind of regretting that now a little. Once my uh, meat shield over here goes down, I don't know what I'm going to do. Dwarf. See, he's got AOE moves. Um, but I shouldn't probably, I probably shouldn't just leave this archer just sitting here. Ugh, it's not even gonna kill him. He's the only one I can hit. I am going to give him an extra action. And see if he can throw. Oh, I can't use it because he's in melee range. I am such a failure at life! Uh... That was total fail. Total fail. <laughs> Just got to do 90 to that guy. Let's go, please. So that's a ricochet. It can hit three people. Instead, it hit a box. Didn't hit the guy that's almost dead who is about to go right now. Probably summon three skeletons or heal. I am so enraged by this game right now. All of these guys that I'm fighting right here, they have been summoned round after round. There goes my elf. Like, what? Faster! None of these guys were in the start of the fight. They all just randomly come in. Victors, thanks for following. I'm surprised I'm getting follows while I'm raging. Even in death. No, I'm on normal thorny subject. Because I'm a glutton for punishment, apparently. Look, it's wizards. Hold on, I'm going to give him an extra attack. You get an extra attack this round. We're going to go here. Nice. I killed two and stunned this guy. Uh, Victor says, when the summoner dies, does this creature summon dies too? It depends. These, most of these people that weren't summoned, they just keep arriving every turn to the battle. <laughs> so there's no... But if one of these individuals, like these casters, summons a skeleton or something, sometimes I've noticed they when they die, their summon dies too. But that won't work with these guys. 
Um, I wonder if I can do a brutal shot on this guy and kill him. No, it's going to leave him within an inch of his life. Take that worm! Okay. And he can move now, too. Let's move. Let's get these guys cozy. Nice and cozy. I think we're going to get this, gang. Despite all my complaining. So it's one, two, three spots in front. First time using this ring. Nice. Okay. <laughs> I keep ignoring that guy. Nervous burst. Yeah. Damn. Nice. <laughs> Troll like that. Or the ogre like that. I think we got this. She's running out of mana. Nice heal. <laughs> this guy's like, how come nobody will fight me? You think your favorite part is the Firebird crit fail? What? That's the worst part. Go, yeah. go. <laughs> this is the MVP right here, the Trollkenstein. I mean, he doesn't do much damage, but he was able to totally occupy all these guys <laughs> while our party dealt with the real threats, you know? What is the troll's attack? The summoned one? Ugh. He's got like three different moves, but none of them are like... Increíble. And that's when ten more spawn. Bite your tongue. Uh, yeah. Slanksters. So is the Amulet of Chaos the DLC or is it the base game? Amulet of Chaos is the base game. Uh, Ruins of Limis. L-I-M-I-S. Is the DLC. Yeah. Amulet of Chaos is the main game. Ruins of Lemis is the DLC. Don't miss. <laughs> you thought he had a special attack like vomit or something? Nothing or something. Are you talking about my ogre or the summon guy? Here's my ogre. My ogre does have vomit and burps and all kinds of gross things. This was the summoned Trollkenstein. He didn't really have anything gross. I can't believe we're going to get this, gang. So here's something gross. Here we go. He just puked up a head and threw it at someone. What are you gonna do? Oh, that's what you're gonna do. Get out of here. You hope there's some good loot at the end of it? 
Well, it's probably the end of the DLC. But I guess it'll help us whatever. There's two more DLCs coming out for this game, so I guess whatever loot we get will help us with that. Here I am. I have to say, like, some of the magic items have been really cool in this uh, DLC because it gives you, like, new skills and stuff, which is great. Um, however, some of the actual items have been barely better than what we had before, and they come with drawbacks. I hope, I hope the next, uh, I hope the next set of loot we get in other DLC is, like, a definite step above what we have. <laughs> Ranger goes down. Yeah, some of them have a downside. Most of them have a downside. Besides, like, the, the summoning stuff. Is it just this guy? All you can eat is my... <laughs> um... Oh, I knocked him down instead of pushed him back. Just ignore the ranger sitting there on the ground. Oh my god, we did it! Victory! Oh my god, that was incredible. That was really hard. Well, it tastes bad. Reminds me of my granny's soup. Belt of overconfidence. Heroes know the meaning of fear. It's just something that happens to other people. Slots equal zero potion slots? See, that's what I mean. We got the belt of overconfidence, but it gives me zero potion slots. Not that I really use them that often. But it gives me two protection, four courage, two constitution. All right, it's a tanky belt. Omniscious potion of the great Trilobian. Once consumed, this potion increases tenfold the cognitive functions of its uh, user for a short duration, allowing miraculous feats. For example, that's how hard pretzels were invented. It's good. Got a potion. What was the other thing? Uh, it was a belt, right? No! It can't be! Oh, yes. Defeated by such amateurs! I will be back, surely. I, dang it. Holy cow, he was tough. And so was the chicken. This rocks. Crom is happy. More, more. Let's kill all the necromancers, and then all mercenaries, and then some demons, and dragons, and gods. We'll bust their heads between two planets. Know your place. Euclid shall not tolerate ghosts acting like the living, nor paupers like rulers. Uh-oh, which... Hey, I'll, I'll, I'll keep to myself. The priest is anyway, the best. Anyway, this is Ducky Roll, but let's go get my 50,000 gold coins, you turnips. And since the thief is dead, he forfeits his share. What? We'll talk about our shares later. <laughs> All right. I have the phylactery chicken and Ephelis's ashes. This should do to prove his demise. Well, it's not as messy as carrying a heart around. All right, we'll get the dough and leave this undead pop stand behind us. And resurrect me. Why does he want to be de re re Why does he want to be resurrected? So, for anybody who doesn't know, the thief was so cowardly in the main game. He's constant. That was his whole like personality, talking about how scared he was and how to avoid danger and all that. Right? Now he's he he dies at the end of the main game and then. He's tr joining us for the DLC. Uh, he's not hes not cowardly anymore. He's like... You heard him. He wants to kill all the dragons, all the demons, all the mercenaries, everybody. So why would he want to suddenly be restored to life? To get his fair share of the treasure? Maybe. Search the room for books. I am. I'm trying. We have one more book we didn't get. Oh, there's Good this room here. Granite, heavier, but sturdier. Oh, 
Ground doesn't need a map. That's the room here. I can't open that. How would one open that? Maybe it's not the end gang. Alright, let's go. We're going in circles. We are. Save. Beat Necro. So we're about to hit the window where the floor refinishing guys might be here. They said they'd be here between like one and three or something. So I have to immediately like run AFK and then wrap up the stream in haste. You know why? That's why we started a little early today. Strange, I should be smelling Eliphas's blood, but you reek of dead poultry. It's the, the chicken, which, and the, the thing, you know. You're <laughs> spouting nonsense, and I'm not even using my glamour. Eliphas turned to a lich, and this chicken was his phylactery. Here are his ashes. And my cousin shears sheet with a toothbrush. Hmm, I see. These are indeed the remains of that self-indulgent pig. Much less appetizing than his heart. But it'll do. Thanks. It was quite easy, actually. Come on, don't overdo it. And now we want gold! Of course. Gold is to dwarves what blood is to vampires. I will reward you. And what about the thief's permanent resurrection? Ah, oh, yes, of course. Produce his corpse. His corpse? His corpse? I have to incarnate his soul back into his body. We don't have that. Otherwise, it'd be a summoning, not a resurrection. Or possession, if I used someone else's body. But it never lasts. Here, I have his ashes! <laughs> I'm so sorry. I can't resurrect piles of ashes. Uh, just as I thought. Indeed, it's one of the basic rules of necromancy. Duh! What do we care? I'm not the dead one, at least. Being selfish is mean. You should think more of others. Yeah? Well, you should think more, period. It's not easy, is it? <laughs> no coming back to life for me. Well, being a spectre isn't all that bad, after all. And I can't be killed, which is at least something. As soon as you leave the ruins, the spectre will lose stability and vanish. What? <laughs> no! <laughs> Wait, there's still something I can do. There. I've enchanted this skull to turn it into a vessel for your friend's soul. That's the best I can do. How bloody awful! I don't want to spend all eternity in some skull. Oh, come on, don't be so picky. You can still talk, that's a perk, innit? Now get out! I have to repair the damage caused by those phallocratic necromancers and go back to sleep. The land of Fang is not yet ripe for my domination. We'll leave you to your housework then. Now, let's get back to Minranthir. Should be more peaceful. Poor, poor thief. Confinement skull. New quest item. Hey, we got the 50,000 gold. Uh, okay, confinement skull. Used as a vessel for the thief's soul. How funny is that? The poor get poorer. All right, we also got the belt of overconfidence, right? Who should we give that to?
Protection, Courage, and Constitution. What's your belt do? Health points and Constitution. No dwarf. way I'm giving it away. Movement and Sprint. Crap, what a mess. His is protection, physical resistance, but his movement goes down. Hey, okay, let's give it to him. You dog. But no slots for you. Okay, at least his movement speed's not in the toilet. Oh, hers is just two slots. How funny. So you get his leftover belt. One slot, one protection, two crit damage. Minus one movement, though. It's so bad. But it gives her protection. Exactly what I needed. Okay. Hard to steal when you're a specter, Demon King? True. Phallocratic, is that a word? I have no idea. I guess we go back to the surface. Go back to the ruins. Ruins entrance. I'm so happy we beat that fight. That was hard. Definition of phallocratic, relating to, resulting from, or advocating masculine power and dominance. Ah, okay. Today I learned. I don't feel all that well. Maybe because we're leaving the ruins. I'm turning intangible! Where did he go? Into the magic receptacle. Didn't you listen? Nope. Uh, seriously? What's a receptacle? It feels cramped. It's tight, but kind of cozy. Smells a bit moldy, though. Well, since I can still communicate with you, not all that bad. A commoner's last dignity is to go quietly. Mayhaps we could hide this skull far from my noble eardrums. But no. Here. Now, we're back to where we started. Friendo doggy bag. Alright, now this is the guy we've been waiting for the whole time. He told ah, us to, he told us to wait here. Perfect. I found what I was looking for. Good. Everything alright? You didn't touch anything? Yep. Uh, all good. Oh, we were very good. Still, there was this... Would you shut up, you sandal-wearing moron? You shut up, mud miner. Ha <laughs> ha those two. They're always so... Well, you sure had us running around. I can explain. Go ahead, do your thing. These lawless individuals have used violence on my person to coerce me into teleporting them here, despite my rebuttals. What? But you scallywag. No, we didn't. mid here. You're under arrest for violating the wizardry laws of the Land of Fang. Illegal use of magic, organized fraud, artifact embezzlement. Poppycock! Not finished. <laughs> Thievery, possession of stolen relics, embezzlement of dungeons, funds, property, magic blackmail, arcanic concealment, astral perturbation. Baseless slander! Grand level theft, <clears throat> use of counterfeit money. Illegal scroll crafting, use of magic in urban area, <laughs> illusion assisted fraud. All right, we get it. But wait, young fellow. I have here some documents you should peruse before proceeding. You never stop, do you? Just look at them. Hmm. So, 
Oh, it's... no. And how impossible. I'd like to draw your attention to page 112 and the affixed etching. It's... I doubt that... Uh, all this time I, I thought there were no witnesses. You can even see the tentacles. <laughs> wow, I forgot that Myrtle was there too. What? Mm. What? Nothing. Is this blackmail? It's... All right. You win. <laughs> what? That wasn't in the script. I'm powerless. And look, page 136. Ah, well, that's awkward. I forgot we managed to shove all those in the, um, with, uh, oh, look, a chicken. And good old Roger. But where's his hand? Oh, no. The quoted witnesses leave no place to doubt. We're busted. I'll warrant the production. We have to let him go. I see we've come to an understanding. Keep this one, it's just a copy. The original is kept in a faraway astral plane, and will pop up to whom it may concern if anything happened to me. Leave us now, you crook. To like blackmailing them? crossing paths again. Temporal matters are not part of my core business. They generate too much prejudicial hassle for my clientele's customer experience. So, we'll never be seeing you too, then. <laughs> Sorry, but I must bring someone back to the Dungeons Fund. What? Swindled fools as you may be, you're under arrest. What? You're abusing your authority! Well, sue me, then. After your own trial. Can we still keep our levels? Come on, we destroyed a powerful undead guy! Do you have proof? Yes, uh, we have the chicken phylactery of the leech, and... A chicken phylactery? Yeah, right. <laughs> We're very serious. This Eliphas warlock turned into a lich. Eliphas? Ha! <laughs> He's a wizard of good repute and a recurrent donator to the Dungeon Fund's charity it's fair for the children. You'll need better. Perfect. At any rate, you'll get a stiff fine for escaping an official condemnation. And don't plan on keeping what you acquired illegally, either. What? You're shitting me! Is this what you call an ending? Good riddance. Still, I always thought no one had seen me in that, um, you know, with the... Are we still So rolling? the narrator was involved God. in that scandal? <laughs> the narrator got blackmailed, too. How funny. So did we lose our 50,000 gold? All right, there we go. DLC number one. Done. Yeah, narrator and that fine man all had a party. All right, thanks so much to the folks at um, Dead Villagers for sending us a copy of the game so we can check this out. There are two more DLC upcoming. Highly recommend Dungeon of Neho book, especially if you like turn-based combat, fantasy RPGs, and if you like comedy. Hashtag game if you want to check it out. Um, now we have to make an interesting decision. 